Welcome to Cool Computers, a digital media academy certified schools course for students in pre-K and kindergarten that explores how computers function and the many ways that we can use them. Computers are a daily part of most of our lives, whether we're researching, reading, watching, sharing, chatting, playing, or listening. We use smartphones, tablets, and computers all the time. Though these devices have transformed how we live, work, and play, many of us use them without giving much thought to what's happening inside these amazing devices. We touch the screen, push some buttons, and wait for the magic to happen. But it's not magic. At Certified Schools, we believe that every student can and should understand the technology tools that shape our world, and it's never too early to start. So we've designed this course for very young students. In the course, your students will take part in developmentally appropriate activities designed to show that computers are simply very versatile tools that can be used to solve all kinds of problems. After this course, your students will never look at computers the same way again. This course will make extensive use of unplugged games and activities to introduce your students to elements of computer science and coding. To reinforce the idea of computers as tools, you'll help them make connections to easy to understand situations from daily life. In the process, your students will come to understand elements of computers that many people simply take for granted. We recommend that you follow these steps to start your preparation for teaching cool computers. Step one, go to the course overview and teacher guide in the teacher resource module. Step two, to see the learning goals you and your students are working towards, open the course overview and teacher guide, then review the description and key learning outcomes for the class. In cool computers, you'll see that students will Learn to identify the difference between input and output devices. Explain the general process of how a computing device works. Give simple pseudocode algorithms to a partner. Understand the computers are tools that help solve problems. And imagine the future of computers and problem solving. Step 3. In the course overview, you will also find the teacher guide and lesson materials. Lesson materials like handouts are in the order they appear in the course, with corresponding lesson and activity numbers. Most teachers find it easiest to download and print the included teacher guide to assist in planning for each session of their teaching. Step 4. Review the equipment and materials you will need for the course. For cool computers, you will need the following for your students. Computers, tablets, or phones, up to you, with an internet connection. Art supplies, including paper and crayons, markers, paper, or colored pencils, input and output devices such as microphones, headphones, speakers, printer, etc. Let's go back now to take a look at the four different modules in the course. Here you'll get a high-level overview of student learning. In Module 1, Tools Solve Problems, students will see how people use different tools to solve problems, and the computers are a type of tool that can solve many different problems. Module 2, What is a Computer? will have your students using computers in different ways to solve different types of problems like calculations, music, and art. Input and Output Module 3 will help students see how input and output devices extend the capabilities of computers. They'll explore how things like microphones make computers even more powerful tools. In the final module of the course, Computers and Code, your students will learn about coding through a series of unplugged activities, meaning no screens needed. In the process, they'll learn how people create the incredibly complex instructions that make our computing devices work. Before you start teaching cool computers, we'll have two more videos for you. Each one will take a close look at specific lessons and learning activities to help you maximize student learning and fun. We'll suggest strategies to help you teach this fairly complex subject matter to your young students. These videos, along with the lesson materials and the teacher guide, are intended to ensure that you have everything you need to effectively implement this Digital Media Academy Certified School course. See you soon!